All right, everybody, keep it going for your next comedian. He is the cook here. He's a good friend of mine. He has a YouTube called The Rock Cast. So uh, give it up for Dennis Reed. Oh, what should I amuse you humans with today? Do, 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 do. I got a hand job from a cat the other day. Uh, that's not a joke. It really happened. Uh, my girlfriend occasionally lets me touch her no-nos. And we're sitting there on the bed just chilling afterwards and her cat comes up to me and just gently while making eye contact places her paw on my nuts. And uh, I didn't pull away, you know, I didn't pull away. Pussy's pussy, right, you know? And uh, she started doing that claw thing and then I really didn't pull away. I'm gonna buy her some fucking catnip. But I think what we should do now is my new plan is we should all be allowed to kill three tweakers a day, okay? Just three a day, that's not a lot. We can really thin out this fucking problem. And then since they're so dried and, and have no nutrients in their body, we burn them as kindling for the people that are outside freezing right now. It kind of goes along with my homeless puppies for the homeless people, you know, where you feed the homeless to the puppies. <laughs> and then you make sure the puppies are neutered in spades so they don't pee on you. I, I live, I'm homeless, <laughs> but I don't smoke drugs. Why? Because I can't afford them because I'm homeless. I did buy these fancy homeless gloves, though. So. Uh, but... Uh, what was the point of that? I don't even know. I got really sad all of a sudden. Why is this girl with me? I have no money. I'm ugly. I, my teeth look like they're going through a rough divorce and right now they're just separated, you know? But the thing is, with this space in the front of my teeth, I can take you out if you come at me like a velociraptor. Like, I will fuck you. Oh, that was funny. How y'all doing tonight, folks? You having a good time? Yeah, we will not be roasting the rock. Everybody, every time somebody tries to roast me, they just describe my life. Like, I'm a piece of human garbage and I don't give a fuck. I fucked Joe's ex-wife and made him watch. I don't give a shit. I know what I look like. I look like somebody that fucking found Jesus and was like, Hey, Jesus, you ever tried crack? And Jesus was like, Nay! And I was like, cool, man. So we smoke some rock. The only problem is when you smoke crack with Jesus, he just hangs around. Yeah. I did a joke one day. The lady's like, you're going to burn in hell. I'm like, yeah, well, I'll be fine with that. It's warm there. I'm from Alaska, so I'm always cold. Uh, frozen place. I came down to uh, the States once in October and went to an Iron Maiden concert in fucking California. I was like, what's up with the sun going up and down? That's pretty fucking cool. It's all this infrastructure. We used to stay in warm by killing animals and crawling into them like Luke fucking Skywalker, you know? I know you're not supposed to fuck them first, but whatever. If you can fuck a bear, you're a fucking Alaskan, all right? My girlfriend's awesome. That's right, I have a girlfriend. I know what I look like. Go fuck yourselves. And uh, the other day she dyed her hair and she texted me a sexy little message. She's like, hey, I'm washing my the dye out of my hair. Do you want to join me in the shower? And I was like, fuck, no, I don't want to stand in the back of the shower for 20 minutes while you rinse out your goddamn hair and I have to look down at myself and be like, why is this girl with me? I have no money. I'm ugly. I, my teeth look like they're going through a rough divorce and right now they're just separated, you know? But the thing is, with this space in the front of my teeth, I can take you out if you come at me like a velociraptor. Like, like I will fucking spit in your face and it, it tastes like sadness. Speaking of sadness, I'm moving back into my truck. Uh, everybody's so concerned. They're like, dude, it's winter time. I'm like, bitch, I'm from Alaska. Winter time happens from December fucking 12th to December 14th. Everybody's like, snow apocalypse. If you can blow the snow off of your windshield, it is not winter. You guys need to learn how to fucking drive. Rule number one, don't spin your tires. You're not going to go anywhere, you moron. Rule number two, don't drive. Call an Uber. I got an awesome dog. Her name is Gypsy Lynn. I named her Gypsy Lynn because I myself am a gypsy. I'm Romanian and Spaniard, which means the Spaniards came down and raped my people in their little wagons. Well, we're out there robbing people and throwing curses on you. What the fuck are you raping us for? That's not cool. But, you know, I'm always broke because I got five kids. Because, again, Alaska, cocaine, long winter nights. I don't want to talk about it. And uh, I was thinking, you know, one good way to make money is I was thinking about starting an OnlyPaws. You know, get, get some pictures of my dog's paws and then, like, slowly dip them into peanut butter and then, like, lick them off for money. My mom signed up. That's, that's the only one. I was uh, homeless for the last six months. Uh, let's be honest. I've been homeless for almost my whole life. I just, I just hate responsibility, and I'd rather live in my truck than have to pay bills with some asshole. But now I moved in. My rent went up 800%, and now I wrote out a budget today and realized that I'm fucked and I'm going to be homeless again real fucking soon. But... Uh, yeah, I got uh, food stamps, which I generally don't like any food stamps. I believe that's for people who really need them, like people that like their kids. And uh, I love most of my kids. They know which ones. They, they'll say it on my, on my grave. Daddy loved most of you, except you, you little fucker. Quit asking for money. I'm homeless. I don't have any fucking money. 
Um, I notice I look good right now because I've been showering again. There's this weird room where like you go inside of it and instead of paying a whole load of piss on you to get clean, there's water just falls out of the sky. There's another room where there's like the seat that you pick up the thing and you can piss in there, which is way better than the way I normally do it, which is trying to line up like a jet airline refueling with a water bottle, which is really sad because I can line up to a water bottle. I'm not talking wide mouth either. I'm, I feel more sorry for my girlfriend than any of you do.